Hey guys, today we're back with another video, and today we're going to do the Vampire Knives versus the Scourge of the Corrupter. Leave your suggest leave your suggestions in the comments below on what I should do, and leave in the comments below which one do you think will win, which one is better, in your opinion. And let's get on with the video. The Scourge of the Corrupter does more damage, and uh, uh, every time you hit an enemy or hit a block. Uh, it sends in little eaters that come after your enemy. It could be a boss, it could be basically any kind of enemy. It does more damage as well. Uh, the I don't know really what the best modifier is for it, but right now these are both godly, and this does like 90, 96 damage, I believe. Good against um, uh, harder enemies, you just stay away from everything and start shooting. Gosh darn thing! Dang. I might kill these bags. And as you can see, it killed the wyvern. <laughs> On to the vampire knives. The vampire knives do not do much damage, but if you hit an enemy, it does heal you a bit. It shoots, uh, I don't really know how much at a time. Because I Both the Scourge of the Corruptor and the Vampire Knives go, uh, uh, very fast speed. And, um, the Vampire Knives do less damage than the Scourge of the Corruptor. But they're still pretty good because they heal you every time you hit an enemy. This could be really good if you're low on health on a boss fight and you cannot take any more healing potions. Because you either run out or you're on the time limit thing. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Uh, like I said in the start of the leave your leave a comment down below. See which one's better. And also for suggestions. I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.